What is up, guys? My name is Augustine from Debatable Football Opinions on Instagram, aka DFO. That is not how my intro goes. I messed it up somehow. What the heck? And we're back with another video. This time, episode four of Spurs Manager Mode. And we have a lot of things to do. We have 90 million in our transfer budget. For those of you who don't remember, we are just in the middle of the season. We're doing okay ish. Like, we're doing okay in the table, you know, at like fifth place. We're still in our domestic competitions and uh, we're in the round of 16 of the UCL. We go against Atletico Madrid, for those of you who don't remember. So, I think this episode is going to be a little bit um, on the short side. I think I'm going to try and play until February, March, because if we do make the final of the Carabao Cup, we're in semifinals right now. If we do make the final, I am gonna have to play that game because that's one of the rules that I established in this manager mode So if we do get to the Carabao final, I'm gonna play it and that will be the end of the episode basically But let's not get ahead of ourselves because we still have to win the semifinal versus Chelsea So I think the semifinal game is gonna be tougher than our actual final But before we do that we have to head into FA Cup against Leeds the round three very early on in the FA Cup But we have to win this game a lot of you guys left me suggestions and recommendations about uh, what players we need to sign. As you guys know, we sold Bergwin and we managed to get 90 million from him. So now that it's the middle of the season, January, winter transfer market is open. We have a lot of money to spend on certain players. And a lot of you guys left recommendations, so I'm going to check those out. But on the meantime, since they're scouting and since we're getting a little bit of information on them, we're going to just keep on playing, keep on advancing while, you know, we get that going. So without further ado, let's get into Leeds United. I'm just going to have most of my starting lineup I did put Mason Mount in there just because well Leeds United is kind of a toughy game and it is the FA Cup and I you know I do want to make it far in that and potentially win it most of the squad is good to go they're rested and they've been improving quite a lot especially Sancho and Kane like they're almost at that 90 rated so we're gonna go ahead and quick simulate this and just hope that we can pull up a win against Leeds and advance into round four of the FA Cup this is taking forever and we win Harry Kane and Harry Winks once again that double Harry combination it's happened a while like I expect Harry Kane to score but not Harry Winks not as much as he has but we get that out of the way and now is the game that you guys have been waiting for the semifinals of the Carabao Cup versus Chelsea I probably should have rested a little bit because this is a tough game and our people are probably gonna be tired but before we head into who we're gonna sign and whatever we are gonna go against Chelsea oh uh, yeah I probably should have rotated a lot of our players are really tired we're gonna bring in uh, Dyer just because Harry Winks is very tired might have to bring in Danny Rose Harry Maguire is just gonna have to play because we don't really have another center back that is fit to play against a team like Chelsea I mean we have Tinganga but he's 73 you know Harry Kane Sancho are also tired but I mean my other option is Brewster and I'm not gonna put him you know tough game for us London Derby semifinals of the Carabao Cup if we do win we'll face either Leicester City or West Ham in the final of the Carabao Cup so you know pretty easy game if you ask me and I I will get to play it and <laughs> I am pretty good at FIFA so we'll probably win it but we have to get through this first actually I'm gonna go and do this. You guys have asked me to do this uh, in important matches, so I'm just gonna watch the game instead rather than uh, just quick simulate it and just get a result. This is a new feature that FIFA 21 has that I haven't gotten to see a lot of, but it's supposed to be really cool. And I know you can jump in and play as you watch the game, but I'm not gonna do that because, you know, I'm only playing finals, okay? So there you have my lineup, there you have their lineup, and we're gonna hope for the best. This is actually pretty cool, what the heck? Why haven't I done this before? I guess I'll do this for like exciting matches. Kind of like this one and you know, UCL or whatever, stuff like that. Come on, we need that defense to be solid. Oh, was that the post? Did they hit the post on their first ever chance? Oh God, okay, we're not doing, we're gonna struggle a little bit. Chelsea are doing much better. From what I've seen, they're, they're attacking a lot more. They're shooting. We haven't had any chances. Dude, this is actually really exciting. I'm like, no, 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 fuck, hold up. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Get in there. Do not let them shoot. Let's go. Let's get that counter. Come on. I feel like I'm in the stadium. <laughs> I know that sounds stupid, but you get me. We started doing a little bit better, attacking a little bit more. But n but neither team is getting there. Oh, we got a free kick. Okay, cool. Okay, come on. Hurricane, score this. Oh. <laughs> okay, no, nothing happened from there. <laughs> I thought they, they were going to pull something off, but no. <laughs> All right, well, they're getting this counter, and it's looking dangerous. Oh, no. Oh, fuck. Team Werner scores for them. 1-0. And it looks like that's first half. Let's head into that second half. Damn it. We're doing good. They only have two shots, and we only have one. I mean, there's not a lot of things going on, but still, I expected a little bit more from us. 
I really hope that whatever signing we make is gonna make a difference because we need to fix up our midfield. I mean, don't get me wrong. I like Harry Wings and I like Dyer, but the rating is just too low. I can check their ratings. Oh, that's dope. I can see who's doing good. Oh God, they almost scored. <laughs> I can see who's doing good and who's doing bad. Our forwards are not doing good. Skip is actually the man of the match along with Deli Ali. Yes. Get a shot in. Yes. One no one. Harry Kane scores. Good stuff. Good, good, good. Okay. Oh God. I kept, I kept seeing them pass around the ball like so close to the area and like so close to the goalkeeper. I'm like, why the fuck aren't they shooting? And then they, then they shot and we scored. 1-1. One, one. It's not over till it's over, baby. Get in there. Get in there. No, don't let them shoot. Get in there. Step. Good stuff. What happened? It's a free kick. Why is the ball inside the, inside the area? Is that is that an indirect free kick? What the heck is this? Oh god, and it went out. I thought it went in. Why the heck was the ball inside the area? That should have been a penalty. Unless it's some weird indirect free kick that they don't even do in FIFA that I know of. It couldn't have been an indirect free kick. Because the guy shot it. You're supposed to get a touch. Oh, whatever. Anyways, I don't know. Dude, it's minute 85. <laughs> this thing is going to hit to extra time. And I'm not going to... I'm not here for that. Oh god, don't let them shoot. They're going to get a last minute goal. Uh, I just jinxed myself, didn't I? Oh, let's go. Let's get that counter, boys. Come on, come on, come on. Come on, Harry Kane. Good passing. Pass it to Harry. Shoot it, Harry. Come on. Somebody shoot the ball, even if it's from far. Oh, this thing is heading to extra time. Or is it not? Is there no extra time? Oh, my God. Is it two, is it two legs? And my dumbass is here thinking it's going to be extra time. I just wasted, like, t five minutes watching that. <sighs> We still gotta get into the second leg. Anyway, guys, thank you for wasting five minutes with me. Uh, I guess we can check out the people that we've scouted. <laughs> I can't believe I just watched that whole thing excited as fuck. And it was just the first leg. Typical Augustine. Okay, so somebody suggested James Madison, and that is a good idea because he's quite young. He's 82, and he can play center mid, as well as on the left wing and center attacking mid. So that's pretty versatile, if you ask me. Somebody else also suggested Jack Grealish, but he just moved to Everton. I don't think we can sign him. Oh, we can. But um, he's a little bit older and lower than James Madison. So I'll just go for James Madison, probably. Other people suggested Todd Cantwell, but uh, I haven't gotten his report yet. Same thing with Phil Foden and Matt Mason Greenwood. I'm sure they're great players, but right now we're going to go for somebody who's already established rather than just a young player. Because we already have young players that will be great for the future. You know, Skip, Deli Alley, you know, you know the deal. We have the young players. We need to get players that are already established, like James Madison, that can still kind of go up in the future, you know? So um, we also don't want to spend a lot of money. We're going to see if we can kind of play or swap, even though we do have the money. But I mean, if we give out maybe, I don't know who the heck. No, I actually looked around all our players and we don't have anybody that we, we could, you know, transfer swap uh, other than Sun. But no, I, I wouldn't find it fair. I guess we'll start with like 40 million and just call it a day. Okay, they want 60. We can we can meet somewhere in there. Like I'll do 45. They're probably going to say 50 and then we'll go from there. You know, Okay, yeah, that's what that's exactly what I was expecting. I'm going to say 47 and it looks like we got it. Now we just got to talk to James Madison and it looks like we'll have the player ready for the second half of the season. He wants to be important. He wants to be with us four years. I'll move that to five. He doesn't want a release clause that works by me and then hopefully his transfer budget isn't that expensive I'm gonna give him 80 a bit of a bonus and just call it a day and if my calculations are correct Which they are he is now our player We just signed James Madison and we still have a bit of money if I go right here I can move around the wage budget and we still have about 45 million still a lot of money We can do quite a lot with that I guess we're going to wait to see how much Cantwell Mason Greenwood and Phil Foden are wait Bayern want Harry Wings. What the heck? Why? <laughs> they want to pay 32 million for him. Which, what? I mean, he's not bad, but he's not like a Bayern type player. I'm just going to reject it because we, you know, we need a midfielder. But that's just weird. <laughs> Anyways, we go against Fulham next. And uh, we do have to keep on winning because, as you can see, we're fifth on the table. And uh, our opponents are not far away, but we can't let them get farther. You know, we got to keep on winning. Because we got to get to that top four. Even better, like top three, top two is what I would expect from a team like this. I'm going to leave the lineup as it is. I am going to put Tanganga in because I want to rest up Maguire for that Carabao Cup second leg. And, uh, you know, just have Mason Mount on the left side. And I'm also going to have James Madison. I know that we just brought him in. Where is he? 
There he is. I'm going to put James Madison. Whoa. Okay, that's CDM. That's why. Okay. If I put him up here and then just change it to a 4 through 3 attacking. Yep, that works. We're also going to have to change Skip into a midfielder, like just a center mid. I'll find out how to do that because I, I'm not, I haven't gotten adjusted to the whole thing yet. But you guys kind of gave me some tips and, and showed me how to do that. So we're going to try and do that right now. Oh, that's what it is. There you go. Okay, so that means I can convert Skip into a center mid. I don't know how long it'll take or whatever, but... Is that all? How do I do it? That's it? Now we just... That's it? I don't... I don't know. I selected it. I don't know how he actually becomes a midfielder, like a, an actual center mid, but I don't know. We'll see, I guess. We're going to quick simulate this. None of that watching stuff anymore. Just we're going to head straight into the result. And we win 3-1. This is a game that we needed to win. Let's pick up a form. Sancho scored. Son and Harry Kane, our top three score. Chelsea just lost 4-0. So, and they're right above us. So that's good for us. Hopefully we can get into that top four. And yes, we do. Top four it is. Leicester City fall down to fifth. And now we just have to catch up to Man City, Chelsea, and, and Liverpool. <laughs> <laughs> They're so far away. We're gonna keep on advancing and our next game will be a week after and it's gonna be Newcastle another game that we should be able to win. Oh god We just got hit by transfer offer for son. That's a lot of money But I'm not trying to get rid of son right now. I just I can't not right now I know that that's a lot of money But okay since we made up that rule of like we have to get rid of our non-English player by season two. I'm trying to use Son as much as I can, and then I'm gonna try. I'm gonna sell him next season. I know that that was a lot of money, and you guys probably want me to sell him now rather than wait a little bit more. It was tough, but I'll do it. I promise. We'll we'll probably get more money later on. God dang it, that was a lot of money. A hundred million for Son. I could have just bought Greenwood, and I think I did the right thing. Well, we'll sell him later on. Okay. Anyways, into the game we go. Quick simulating against Newcastle. Let's pick up a win and keep the form going. Yes, we do. 2-1. Sun scores. And then skip as well in the first minute. We dominated that game. That was like seven shots, six chances. Good stuff. We're, we're continuing the episode on a good form. We need to keep on building that form because we need to beat Chelsea. We need to go into that Chelsea game on a good level. Speaking of, we face Arsenal. And if we beat them, everything's going to look much, much better from now on. Okay? And this is a, this is a must-win game. Okay, I'm gonna put the best squad out there because later on we we face who are those people <laughs> for the FA Cup round four So we, sh we should be fine. This just reminded me that last time we faced each other It was a 1-1 draw and that was at our house at our stadium now We're facing them away, but we I think we do have a much better team now uh, We're coming from a good form, you know, I mean their strikers in Keita. I don't even like they lost Obama Yang They're starting Ozil <laughs> like how high rated can Ozil be nowadays? Like 83? I'm not, I don't fear this team. I don't even know who that center back is. Mari? Okay. Okay, Mari. We're going to beat you. We're going to destroy Arsenal. Come on, boys. <gasps> yes, we do. 3-2. That was tough, but we did it. We had more shots, more chances. We dominated. More possession. We dominated against Arsenal. A great game that we needed to win, and we won in such a great match. We pick up three points against Arsenal. I I'm happy with that. Now we have to win this game. Run four of FA Cup against Sheffield Wednesday. Keep on making our form better and better. Keep on improving as a team. And then we'll head into Chelsea's second leg. I should also mention that this whole form of ours, if it keeps on improving, you know, Atletico Madrid better watch out. Oh, okay, okay. I just got all the final scouts for all the young players. Mason Greenwood, Cantwell, and Foden. So we're going to check out how much rated they are, all that kind of stuff. And then we're going to see if it's worth it buying any of them. So we got Phil Foden, 80 rated at 20 years old. Man City do want a lot of money from him. Mason Greenwood. Again, we could possibly get Mason Greenwood. And then who else was it? Cantwell. Cantwell's a little bit lower rated and we don't really need wingers nowadays. So, I mean, it's obvious that we got to go for Mason Greenwood. Uh, a lot of you guys have told me that his potential is high as a motherfucker. So we're going to go for Mason Greenwood. I think we do have enough money for him. Man United might ask for more than he's worth but we're i think we're prepared for that his current value is 30 we have 44 so we are gonna start at 35 and hope that they don't raise the price too much oh my god they just want that and they just wanted to add a sell-on clause sure i'm cool with the sell-on clause i'm never gonna sell this player now we just have to talk to him how easy was that that was incredible <laughs> Now we have to talk to Mason Greenwood, tell him that he's going to be rotation, and then call it a day. 
Okay, it's sporadic, not even a rotation. Dude, you're 78 rated. He wants to be with us five years. Dude, this is a huge signing. Except he doesn't want a release clause. Everything's working out. Dude, he's taking a wage cut. This was this player was gifted to us. We just got Mason Greenwood and like the easiest transfer ever. The most convenient transfer. And we still have 10 million. We're probably not going to use that. But I think the club likes that uh, we don't spend all our money. So that helps with them too. Now we go against Sheffield Wednesday for the round four. And this is a great opportunity to start some of the signings that we made. You know, Madison and then obviously our new prospect Greenwood and yeah that seems like I rotated enough I don't want to you know over rotate and then just lose against Sheffield Wednesday on the round four of FA Cup so we're gonna win this game we're gonna give it our best and advance to round five keep that form going keep on getting better as a team and oh whoa we just won on aggregate what does that mean this is the only time we faced them we just won 2-1 what does it say aggregate we didn't face them before is that a glitch I think that's a glitch that's gotta be a glitch Anyways, we beat them 2-1. That's what counts. Deli Ali scored. Madison as well. I think that's his first goal. And that works for us. Oh, God. It's good that we rotated because now we go against Chelsea. Oh, dude. I didn't realize how weird Maguire looked in a Spurs shirt. But anyways, it's good that we rotated a lot because now we're going against Chelsea in the second leg of Carabao Cup semifinals. We're going to put our best team possible out there. Son, Kane, and then Sancho. James Madison, Deli Ali. Harry Winks, Chilwell, Stones, Maguire, Reese James, and then Dean Henderson. Our bench is good to go. We're going to head into the second leg. As you can see, our morale is so, so happy. Like, we're almost at 100%. We have a great form going. We've been winning games and games over and over. I don't remember the last time we lost. We haven't lost in this episode for sure. We're going to head into this game. And like last time, we're going to watch it. We're going to go into simulate match and we are going to watch the game. We just came from beating Arsenal in a great game. We, you know, we've been winning games just for fun. So we have to win this game. I just realized that they scored against us away. So they have the advantage even though it was just 1-1. So we do have to score. It can't end 0-0. We do have to score. All right. They're having the ball so far. Be careful. Oh my God. And the first chance. Are you serious? They already score 1-0. It is now we have to go out and score two goals if we score one it goes through extra time if we score two then we advance but we can't let them keep on scoring bro come on let's do this come on i put my best team out there for something for a reason get a shot somebody shoot it shoot it yes we win oh, we scored i said we win what the fuck we just scored james madison our new signing with a 1-1 now it's headed to extra time if we score again we'll be good to go we'll head into the final oh, oh my god dude son just got in between three players and then he couldn't like, then he got the shot but it was straight out the keeper all right good passing the team's actually passing pretty well i think we're playing better too if we check the stats yeah we're playing way better we have more possession chances and shots look at us okay we get a corner spank that in Okay, dude, look at that possession. We have 61. They have 39. We're we're dominating against this team. Come on, keep on getting further. Keep on passing well. Yes, beautiful. Ah, come on, we're we're passing so well. We just need that end product. We need to start shooting. Ah, please don't let them get, dude. If they score, now that we're dominating against them, now that they're playing so badly, that's just taking the piss. All right, boys, minute 60. We need to we need to get a goal. Neither side has had any shots in the second half or any chances at all. No. Get in there. Step, please. Don't let them shoot. Okay, let's get that counter. Oh, God. This is actually... They're getting the best of us in the second half. Let's get out of there. Let's get out of there. Come on. Get the ball. We'll go. Oh, that's a foul. Okay. No, 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 no. Okay. Come on. Come out of there. Don't let them shoot. Yes. Yes. Good stuff. Good stuff. Let's get that counter. Come on. Let's, we got to get out of there. Come on. Yes. Good pat. Come on, man. It, looks, it doesn't look like we're going to get a goal. We have been... I don't know what happened to our first half form. I don't understand how we can play so great in the first half. And then just do this. This is our only chance we've got in this half, dude. Come on. Oh, my God. Come on. One more. Somebody, please take a shot. It's minute 90. Minute 91. Take a shot. Take a shot. Shoot, please. Stop walking. Stop doing... You're in front of the keeper. It's going straight to penalties. I'm going to keep it as it is. I'm just watching. Whoa, hold up. This is too much to take in. Oh, fuck. We just missed. Let's go. Okay, hold up. I can't even react to this. We just fucking missed again. Oh, my God. It's 2-0. We need to make this one. 
Okay, we made it. Come on, dude. This is bullshit. Block something! I'm not even... Okay. We have to block this one. We blocked it! Okay, now you have to make it in tight up. Make it in tight up. Yes! 3-3! Three, three. Sudden death! Sudden death! Oh, okay, we have to score this one. We have to score this one or we out. Are you fucking serious? I fucking hate this. Why the fuck? That was so much to take in. I did not edit the whole thing. I did not cut any clips or anything. That was literally how it was. What the fuck? Dude, that means we're not going to be in the Curve of Cup final. You're not going to watch me play. I'm not going to play. And we lose to fucking Chelsea on penalties. That game was BS. And they now they face West Ham. On the Carba Cup final. I guess no trophy for us so far. I'm pissed. I thought that's what this episode was gonna be about. Me playing the Carba Cup final. But no, we're not we're not reaching it. And now we face United as as if things couldn't get worse. <sighs> Alright. We move on boys.